What up? What's going on, guys? Your boy Jez. Welcome back to another MMA fight, UFC. And uh, we won our last fight with Fabricio Verdum. And unfortunately, it wasn't, you know, with the sub. And I say unfortunately, like, I, there was never even an opportunity if you guys saw that last fight. But nonetheless, man, um, he was somebody that, you know, if I was going to get my first submission, it might have been with him. But um, let's go ahead and get another fight. I, a lot of people have been asking for Bruce Lee. So uh, let's see if we can go on ahead and get some Bruce Lee gameplay for you guys. Bruce Lee is a glitch. And uh, by no means... Or, you know, do I mean that, like, I'm going to dominate? You know, I'm going to make him look bad, just like I make anybody else look bad. Um, I'm fairly new at the game. There's still so much to learn. But for the most part, did I not pick the right division? Okay, I did. But for the most part, when I go up against somebody who has Bruce Lee and they know what they're doing, it's very, 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 very frustrating. He's extremely quick. Uh, okay, right now we got the difference between, you know, we're going to go with the the smaller Bruce Lee give us a stamina and speed edge. So uh, hopefully that gives us the advantage. Whenever you fight somebody who knows what they're doing with Bruce Lee, it's extremely frustrating. He's fast. He's very quick. You know, his strikes are lightning. There were times where he would jab me, right? And I wouldn't have my hands in the bow. And, um, <laughs> and to try to prepare for the next punch, I would try and hold right trigger. He would connect with the jab before I raise my hands up. That's how quick he is. Like... He is so fast. And again, I'm not going to make him look like how he should be used. You're going to see Bruce Lee in this gameplay like, what? This guy is OP? You just you just got knocked out in 11 seconds. Yeah, I know. There's most people who know what they're doing. All right, we're going up against Georgies. Um, again, if you guys would like more fights, man, uh, definitely let me know in the comment section. Hit that like button. It definitely lets me know you guys enjoy the series and you guys would like me to bring more. Let me know which fighters you guys would like to see. And uh, also, if you guys are new, hit that subscribe button. Greatly appreciate it. You know, we uh, upload sports here. So, um, you know, you are welcome to uh, join the Biblical Pantherines. All right, so we're going up against Georgies, obviously, uh, one of the best wrestlers ever in MMA. Somebody who is very, very deadly in both aspects of ground game and stand-up. So, he, he's he's going to be scary, and he's, de he's definitely a bigger fighter. That looks like 170 GSP, and I got, what, 155 Bruce Lee. That's one thing I don't like, how they combined weight classes. You know, you can have a middleweight fight a light heavyweight. I don't think that's fair, you know, to have 185 Weidman go up against, you know, 205 John Jones, but that's how they have it. You know what I mean? Unfortunately, that's how they have it. I don't know why, but uh, hopefully we can just not make Bruce Lee look bad. That's all we're trying to do. Trust me, if anybody knows anything about this game, you know Bruce Lee is a beast. All right, let's get into it. All right, we got to try and, you know, uh, I don't even know what my game plan is, man. Always start off with a leg kick, always. Let him know, I will attack them chicken legs. All right, I know I have the faster fighter, so. Okay. You know, I'll go for a takedown too, brethrens. Okay, what I like to do is when they strike like that to the head, I like to sway and then go to a quick rib shot. That hook block by Saint Pierre. Okay, he definitely has reach on me, so I got to be careful. Trying to get a single, excellent takedown defense. Uh, I try to catch him off guard. Okay, that's one thing he likes to do immediately after a takedown failing. Is uh, he likes to uh, go for a head kick? So, let me see if I can get him in a clinch. Again, some people just don't know how to how to handle being in the clinch. Looks like he's doing a decent job. He lands a huge knee. Hit him in the legs a couple times. Okay, again, let me see if I can transition in here. Okay, he's not blocking them, sweet baby Ray ribs. He's not blocking the ribs. Okay, now he is. Okay, now we're gonna let go because I, I don't I don't want to get tired. Struggling for position in the clinch. Okay. He tries Woo! Look at Bruce Lee with them takedown defense though. Okay, see if I can catch him off guard with this spinning body kick. Okay, he he's adamant about these takedowns, so. Wait a minute, he transitioned before I did. Come on, Bruce. Flip him. Flip him. Flip that hole one time. Flip him like a burger, baby. Okay, he's blocking the transit. Woo! Bow! 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 Oh, he's quitting. 
Oh, no, he's not. That was just like, that was just like, he has such a dumbass sub. He's not quitting. Okay, let me transition before he could transition out of there. Okay, go after that body. Okay, I have no health. No health. Let me just lay here. Let me just get up. It's not, it's in my, damn it. He's going to go for the sub. Oh, no, he's not. Okay, just get up. It's in my best interest to play smart. Whoo. Good inside leg kick. Okay, because he's so worried about the body so much now, probably be a perfect time to go after. There you go, there you go. Get him up against the cage, Bruce. Get him up against the cage, Bruce. Go after the sweet baby Ray ribs. Okay, go after the face. Okay, he's just blocking everything. You know, not a lot of people know you can still attack the body from this from this position. Okay, okay, now 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 go run for your life. Oh, uh, okay, I'm nervous. I am nervous. Please don't go for a sub. Please don't go for a sub, whatever you do. Oh, he's not going to have enough time. It don't matter. He would have had it, too. He would have had it. That is very, very dangerous on my part to do that. Thankfully, <laughs> the round ended. I let go, but he shot immediately. I should have expected that, but I didn't want to get caught with the punch, so I was just waiting for a strike. And with no energy, you can't block, so... Definitely my fault. Um, I got to watch my stamina. We almost, almost lost. We got lucky. We got lucky right there. His body is pretty damaged. So um, I got to watch out for the takedowns. And any uh, swing that I get, any parries I get, straight to the body. You know, low combo, then back up. Nice defense. He blocked that. That's a huge body shot. Okay, he might be going to the body too, so. Okay. Look for the single. Good hook to the body by Lee. Nice combination. Woo! Oh, he don't know where we were striking right there. Woo! You see it? That's what I don't like. I, I call him, you know, momentum backwards from a punch. I mean, forward. Oh, dang it. I didn't see that happening. That's my fault. All right. Transition in the mount. Transition in the mount, brothers. Okay. This guy is pretty good at the ground. I'll give him that. Oh, yeah. I have full health. There should be no way. Wow. I didn't get that. There you go. Okay, get up. That's a big shot right there. Get up, Bruce. Okay, this is not where I want to be with big ass GSP on me. Like not at all. With a good right hand. While mounted here, he's got control. It's not even letting me get up. I have to get up. I have to get up. Strike to the head. Woo! Okay, yeah, yeah. He's better on the ground than I am. So I, I really have to watch those takedowns. How is he transitioning faster than me, though? I have the quickest transition in, in the Northern Americas. And he completes the takedown with the throw. Okay, yeah, he, he's really just really going for these. His arm is out. He's earned the reversal. Right to half guard. And back up. He's got a very nice right hook. Man, those shots... Okay, his body's still pretty much hurt. Damn it, I'm trying to defend it, man. I really am. Oh, he's got me in a crucifix. But he transitioned so quick where I can't even do anything. Okay, come on, Bruce Lee. Use that speed, man. One more. One more from out. One more from out. There you go, baby. Round's almost over. Just go crazy. Just go crazy. He gets in a full Round's almost over. He's not going to be able to do anything anyways. 
All right, who won that round? I don't know. That was a good round. That was definitely a good, tough round. I could see where um, you say if I won, I understand. If you say GSP won, I understand. He definitely had the advantage in takedowns. Uh, he's using him very GSP like. Yep. Yeah, unfortunately, Elgato being Elgato ruins the video footage from here on out, as it's been doing the entire week. My footage has been being distorted, ruined this entire week. Thankfully, uh, I paused the game, as you're going to see coming up. Um, and uh, you still get to see the third round because I, uh, I paused it, as you see right there. I stopped the Elgato, and I restarted it, and uh, it kind of fixed itself. But there is no live commentary for this round because the Elgato is just, I don't know what is wrong with it. I, I truly don't. I've tried uninstalling it. I've tried reinstalling it. I've tried updating new versions. I don't know. Right there, he caught a couple free shots because I was trying to work the Elgato. I had no idea that um, it was even working at this point um, because I, I thought it was just, you know, done. Uh, whenever I, I look on my screen and um, it gives you a preview on the Elgato of what you're recording. And once I see that it's like two minutes behind... You know, I'm entering the third round, and, and it's still showing me very slow motion footage of the second round where it's not, you know, caught up to where I'm at now. I'm like, oh, it's it's being stupid. It's been doing this all week, and it's very, very, very frustrating, and I apologize. Um, it turns out to be a very good round, as you guys are going to see. Um, you know, the second round, he started mixing it up a lot more. Uh, right there, that's kind of the Bruce Lee cheese <laughs> that I was doing is what you kind of run into when you go up against him. There's a lot of people uh, spam spinning back kicks and head kicks. And it's kind of tough to determine what it is. You know, if you spam spinning head kicks and back kicks and you mix them up, it's tough to tell if it's going for the head or body. Uh, right here, I had a different game plan. I wasn't attacking the head the entire round. It was all body shots. Bam, 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 bam. And he's down for the count. Right here, I decided to go ahead and mix it up a little bit more and go for some head strikes instead of, um, you know, primarily just going for the body which i have been doing all fight long so i knew i caught him off guard caught him with some head strikes right there because he was defending his body um very very closely and why wouldn't he you know i was just you know attacking it all game long so you know this round he was you know making sure he was uh putting a lot of focus on protecting his body caught him in the corner and uh, we caught him with some head strikes, which he was not expecting. And we ended up putting him to sleep. So that's the end of the fight, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Again, I'm sorry the live commentary footage was lost. Um, I don't know. I prob I I'm going to have to get myself a new capture card. Because like I said, man, over half of my footage has just been distorted, ruined. Nothing I can do with it. Uh, thankfully, it happened a little bit here towards the end. And I still got the end of the third round. So it wasn't a lost fight. You know what I mean? So um, again, I apologize, man. But... Leave in the comment section if you, uh, who you guys would like to see next. Uh, hit that like button, man. If you guys you know like online rink matches, you guys would like more. And uh, if you guys are new, go on ahead and hit that subscribe button, fellas. Greatly appreciate it. And uh, right here, we're just looking at the highlights uh, of the fight. And uh, call me with a judo toss, man, from from um, from the clinch. I still don't know how to do that. I got to learn how to do that. But uh, right there, started spamming body punches, body kicks. I said right there, we caught him in the corner. And like I said, I know he wasn't expecting any... Uh, and he had um, strikes because I was attacking the body the entire the entire fight. So, um, and his body was definitely weak from all the punishments. So he made he made sure he put a focus on protecting it. And that round we mixed it up. And same as he did the second round, he was going for takedowns and head strikes. Second round, he mixed it up, striking more towards the body. You know, and that definitely um, caught me off guard. So um, that's what we did to him in the third round. Just mixed it up, and we ended up coming away with the victory. So. Like I said, man, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. We are now on a four-fight win streak again. Hopefully we could uh, get over the hump and go on a five-fight win streak. Last time, I started out 4-0, and we lost two fights in a row. So uh, let's see if we can get our ninth win coming up soon, man. Love each and every single one of you guys, man. It is your boy, GS, and we will be signing out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.